Business owners in downtown Lexington concerned rising crime is impacting business. Georgia MacArthur spent the day talking to bar owners about their concerns. Georgia, what did they have to say? Yes, good evening, Imani. Business owners want people to go downtown and have a good time, but most importantly, they want people to be safe. And I think I can speak, um, hopefully, for all the businesses downtown when I say that um, no single business or no single bar is the root of the problem. Amid the rise in crime, people are growing concerned about violence in downtown Lexington. Operations manager at Creo, Travion McFarland, hears it often. We don't want, we don't welcome people to come in and destroy our property or to start fights or to, to have shootings downtown Lexington. Bar and club owners say their livelihood depends on people feeling safe and coming to spend money. Uh, we also do pat downs of the men too and we check the females purses. The city has been so hot lately. McFarland says his bar tries to do everything to keep the hundreds so of people who come to have fun to not fall victim to crimes. So we want to make sure that people coming into our establishment are safe um, from anything that people may bring in or things that people may tend to start if they're drunk. Lexington police has increased its presence in downtown Lexington after back-to-back -back shootings and property damage that has taken place in the city. You know, I think the Lexington Police Department has done a good job uh, with what they have as far as numbers-wise in order to protect downtown. I think that their focus has reshifted to the right things. They're, they're starting to be proactive instead of reactive. Although business owners appreciate the officers, their customers, not so much. You know, our African-American crowd is here because it's just the vibe. When they see such a large presence of police, it puts them on edge. Um, so our numbers in the past four or five weekends have fluctuated. You know, some weekends were popping, uh, some weekends were not. And McFarland says that Creo hires security guards to reassure its customers. Live in Lexington, Georgia MacArthur, Fox 56 News. Georgia, thank you.